More congestion on roads or more crowded public transportation. That's what could happen if lorries were banned as a way to transport workers, say business owners in Singapore. In a joint statement, some 18,000 local companies called for pragmatic solutions instead. And this would also prevent undue disruptions such as delayed project timelines. Imagine uh, a guy that can be uh, ferried together with a lorry now has to take a separate transport, maybe two transport if you have more workers, right? And you're going to add up road contract congestion. And if you think about that, you know, if they don't take a, a grab because it's too expensive and costly, because it's going to drive up costs, right? They pay pu public transport. Public transport may, may end up taking longer. Your project ends up being delayed. Organizations had called for a ban on lorry transport following two accidents which injured 37 people, including migrant workers. In their statement, employers said they were committed to worker safety, but a ban was a matter of great concern. They stressed that they would continue working with authorities, labor unions and safety experts to come up with new solutions. Some MPs will be raising this issue at the parliamentary sitting tomorrow.